My name is Tony Spilsbury, and my story really begins with savings. I was a busy working mom. My career was working for a big insurance company, saving them money. My husband and I wanted to have more children, and we had twins, a boy and a girl, Connor and Cassidy. Uh, Connor was born blind and severely medically fragile. The doctors, when he was born, didn't think he would make it past the first day. He had a very difficult first two years of his life. He was in the hospital the majority of the time, multiple surgeries, multiple complications. I wanted to maintain some type of normalcy in our family life, even though things were not normal. We had unexpected trips to the emergency room. I was back and forth between the hospital and home, and when we were home, it may have been for a week, two weeks, a month, we were never really sure. So I always wanted to have something at home that created that that normalcy. And dinner time was it for us. Connor is really uh, the driving force behind my need for organization and my need to maximize my time. He's also the driving force behind a foundation that my husband and I created called Nevada Blind Children's Foundation. And we hope to build a school here for other children who are blind. Nevada is one of only two states in the U.S. with no school for the blind. So my need to free up and have as much time to help other families through this foundation was really was really the driving force. Just cooking family dinner is, is a big task in itself, but you throw that on top of so many unknowns throughout the day and, and so much time consumed by not only having twins, but one who's very sick. And I realized what a huge job that was, just to have family dinner on the table every night. And I thought then there has to be some way to make this easier on me. What I found was that if I, if I plan ahead and plan carefully and I used organization, it made it so much easier. When you're trying to stay on schedule through the night and you cook family dinner, sometimes you, you get it done and you get it on the table, but in order to keep that schedule going for the rest of the night, you never sit down yourself. My kids actually said, hey, you know, we actually like it when you sit down and have dinner with us. And um, that's when I, again, realized how important it was to sit down together as a family, that even my kids at such a young age were, were telling me that how much they enjoyed this. I started creating my own weekly meal plans. It became actually a, a fun thing for me to see how I could structure my meals and my planning and my grocery shopping to where I could whip together a dinner in like 10 minutes and still have people say, have my family say, wow, this is really good. I noticed that I was throwing away a lot of wasted food at the end of the week and I thought there has to be a way for me to use that in addition to this meal planning that I do to really get the most bang out of my buck. And not only bang out of my buck monetary, but my motivation was really to save time. I started creating this weekly meal plan for myself that reused ingredients, reused my time throughout the whole week. And that term that I love, reincarnating the leftover, I had this, this meal plan that I realized, wow, I'm saving a lot of money but I'm also saving myself time and I'm also not wondering what to make every day. And I'm, we're not running out for fast food, we're not stopping by for takeout, and I'm not going to the grocery store every day. But I had everything planned out, which allowed me to have so much time freed up for the things that meant the most to me. I shared it with my sister, uh, with my hairdresser. The feedback that I got was overwhelming. Some of the first comments was, oh, I, you know, I already had, I would come home from work and I already knew what I was having for dinner and most of the time it was already halfway prepared for me. So I realized that if it's helping my family and my friends, that maybe I could help other busy moms out there. My hope is that it'll bring that balance, it'll, it'll take that overwhelming feeling away and it'll bring organization into their lives knowing that this could be easy, this can be simple, and you can feel confident. You can feel confident knowing that you're getting these healthy dinners on the table for your family every night and you still have that time to spend with them and still have a little time for yourself. The organized cook isn't just a meal plan, it's about balance and so I incorporate as many money saving tips time-saving tips, anything that I can, that I find that I can incorporate into this system and this book that will help slash the budget, slash your time, I feel will just benefit all busy moms out there.